All right, so we got this uh, weird looking uh, rock stack over here. Check it out. Okay, so this one's definitely a fire pit. Some people were saying that the other uh, rock circle I found was like an Indian hunting blind, native hunting blind. Uh, yeah, pretty cool. Caves over here, I'll check out real quick. It's right next to that some wire right there. Uh, old can, old can, another old can. bone again looks to be animal from the size of the pores the port like how how porous it is on the inside looks to be like an animal rib bone coyote sign bone. I'm only touching it because I know it's animal bone. <sighs> Quickly losing daylight here. Got a shoulder bone here, and a rib bone right here, shoulder, not round enough to be a human shoulder bone, this is a, I don't know, 
Might be an antelope. It's hard to say. Here's the other shoulder bone right here. Smaller shoulder bone actually. See that? A little bit different shape too. See how it's different shape? see much of anything right now. Old shell right here. Oops. Really old shell. Brass. Shotgun shell. I'm on my way back right now. I hear what you said. Yes, I will. I'm on my way back. Over. Alright. Shoulder bone. Losing daylight quick. We're losing daylight quick.
Right, so the area I'm walking in right now is in between Jim Brenner's burnt down uh, trailer and the mines. Most of the mines we've been searching. Uh, so this is just kind of a, I don't know, hilly canyon type terrain. A lot of uh, I guess, uh, ravines, I guess you could call them. Washes. Uh, it's not really a wash, it's more, I guess, of a ravine. When I think of a wash, it's more of a carved out, like kind of a steep canyon. Uh, a lot more of a vertical drop, whereas a ravine's more of like a slanted. Oh, what's going on here with the camera? <laughs> so, washes are more like a vertical drop, steep drop off, where like I think a ravine of a more of like a 45 degree angle, like more of an incline. But yeah, that's what we're checking out right now is this area and it's not the best, best time to be searching with all the snow on the ground, but it is what it is. You can still cover some ground here that's not covered in snow. That's what I'm gonna focus on because it just doesn't make any sense to be trekking in the snow. Can't really see anything. There's a big old timber from one of the mines, I bet. So it's all the snow on the ground, it's going to make it really hard to search until it melts. You can actually see the ground. Just the snow covers everything up.
back to this hillside over here where it's kind of melted because it's just snow everywhere. There's another marker right here. Something in my shoe, feeling it now. <clears throat> There's just a lot of odd things about Dylan's case. I feel like there was like a lot of evidence that was destroyed in the beginning. Really made it hard now to kind of figure out exactly, you know, give us a better idea, but it's just, it is what it is. burner stove here Nesco Right here. 
dog or coyote. Been up here. Rabbit tracks. <laughs> 